Understanding, not another word, unveiling the phrase in English. Hello, dear learners. Today, we're going to explore a very interesting and commonly used phrase in English. Not another word. This phrase might seem simple at first, but it carries a lot of nuances and is widely used in various contexts. By the end of this video, you'll fully understand what this phrase means and how to use it properly in your conversations. At first glance, not another word seems straightforward. It sounds like someone is being told not to speak anymore. But let's delve a bit deeper. Literally, it's used to tell someone to stop talking or not to say anything more. Figuratively, it carries the implication of authority or finality. It's as if the speaker is saying, the discussion is over, and I've made up my mind. This phrase is particularly common in scenarios where someone is in a position of authority, like a parent to a child or a boss to an employee. For instance, a parent might say, not another word, to stop their child from arguing about bedtime. It's a way to assert control and signal that the conversation has concluded. However, it's not always serious or stern. Friends might use it playfully, like when one is teasing the other and the other responds with, not another word, to indicate they've had enough of the joke. English is rich with expressions, and, not another word, has its variants. You might hear, say no more, or, enough said. These phrases carry a similar meaning but can be used in slightly different contexts. Say no more, often implies that the listener fully understands the situation, while, enough said, might indicate that what has been said already sufficiently explains the situation. Congratulations on adding, not another word, to your English repertoire. Remember, understanding the context is key to using this phrase correctly. It's a powerful expression that, when used appropriately, can convey authority, finality, or even camaraderie among friends. Keep practicing, and don't hesitate to use it in your conversations when the moment is right. Until our next lesson, Keep learning and exploring the nuances of the English language.